Hi everyone, in this video we're going to be looking at how to use the transform tools in Makeara Cam. Now we dive deeper into the create tools which lets you create other shapes, as well as the trace tools which lets you trace images or contour files in our other tutorials. But what we're looking at specifically are the different transform tools to manipulate your shapes. Now you'll find sometimes when you import a model like this that it's not the correct scale, it's not the correct orientation, and instead of having to go back to the CAD software to manipulate this, we can easily use the transform tools in Makeara Cam to adjust our parts. The transform tools work for both 2D and 3D files, so of course I'm looking at a three-dimensional model, but we can easily use the same tools when working with 2D shapes as well. So the first thing I would need to do for this part in particular is to scale it. I can switch down to the scale tab here and set a individual length, width, or height, or link the X, Y, Z so that they stay proportional. You can manipulate the individual bars here if you'd like, or what I would recommend is enter a specific size if you know the specific size that you'd like to manipulate your shape to. You can also use the mirror tool if you want to mirror your shape, as sometimes shapes are imported in reverse, especially when you're working with things like two-dimensional SVG files, and you have the option of mirroring things to not only its own orientation, but the center of your stock as well. In addition to mirroring, we also have some simple rotation tools, which lets you rotate on any work plane, either with a set angle or by easily clicking these 90 degree rotation buttons, which are handy. And under the move tools, you'll see that we have the ability to move our object either in a certain direction, free form, or even quick align the stock, which will automatically find the center of your stock and align your shape perfectly in all three axes. If you're working with two shapes like this and you want to center them to each other, you'll notice that you'll have an option for center to center under the transform tools. What center to center does is it allows you to select one object, then your second object, and it automatically will center those objects to each other based on their coordinate system. And after you select a shape, you'll also notice that you have the ability to change where the handles are located. So by default, we're located in the center of our shape. But I can instead move the handles to be, say, on the top of the shape and even in the corner. And what that allows me to do is manipulate different aspects of my shape freely with more precision and control. You can also easily duplicate or clone shapes using the layers panel where I can clone a model and then of course transform that model. And you can select more than one shape at a time and transform them together as a group. So the transform tools give you some really handy CAD and manipulation features right into Make Care Cam. So you can always manipulate and work with the models so that they can be prepared for manufacturing with ease. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more.